Do you ever find yourself trapped in a loop of negative thoughts, obsessing over past mistakes or future uncertainties? This is a phenomenon known as overthinking, a term coined by Nick Trenton in his insightful book. Overthinking is the relentless churn of negative thoughts and worries, a constant replay of perceived mistakes and shortcomings. It's the fear of making decisions or taking risks, the endless analysis of situations without resolution, and the constant need for reassurance or validation. The impact of overthinking can be profound, affecting both our mental and physical health. It can lead to increased anxiety and stress, difficulty in making decisions, problems with sleep, and even physical tension and pain. Overthinking can chip away at our self-esteem and confidence, and it can even damage our relationships. But here's the good news. You might be surprised to learn that overthinking is not an inevitable part of life, and there are tools to help break the cycle. Nick Trenton provides practical strategies to manage overthinking effectively. He presents a comprehensive approach that begins with identifying triggers. Understanding what sets off your overthinking is crucial. Trenton suggests keeping a thought diary to track your thoughts and identify patterns. Next is challenging. Negative thoughts. Once you've identified your triggers, you can begin to question the validity of these thoughts, reframing them positively and developing more realistic perspectives. Trenton also emphasizes the power of mindfulness. Practices such as meditation, yoga, and deep breathing exercises can help calm the mind, focus on the present moment, and let go of intrusive thoughts. Another key strategy is engaging in thought-stopping techniques. These involve interrupting the thought pattern with visualization, positive self-talk, or physical cues when negative thoughts become overwhelming. And remember, in some cases, overthinking may indicate an underlying mental health condition. It's important to seek professional help if managing your overthinking becomes too challenging. But managing overthinking isn't just about stopping negative thoughts. Trenton's overthinking is about cultivating a balanced and thoughtful approach to life. He lays out five principles to guide us on this journey. First, embracing uncertainty. Life is inherently unpredictable and that can be unsettling. But by accepting the unknown, we can alleviate the anxiety that fuels overthinking and open ourselves to new possibilities. Second, practicing self-compassion. Treat yourself with the same kindness and understanding you'd offer a dear friend. This can help build resilience and reduce negative self-talk. Third, focusing on the present. By keeping our attention on the here and now, we prevent our minds from dwelling on the past or worrying about the future. Fourth, making mindful decisions. By considering our options carefully and trusting our intuition, we can avoid the paralysis of overanalysis. Finally, seeking meaning and purpose. When we align our actions with our values, we find a sense of fulfillment that overshadows any temporary discomfort or uncertainty. With these tools and insights, you can transform overthinking from a debilitating cycle into a pathway to a more peaceful and fulfilling life.